morning, everybody. Right, for our devotion today, I want us to think about the Bible. The Bible has two parts, the Old Testament and the New Testament. The New Testament is the part after Jesus was born. It's all about his life and the lessons he taught us. Which brings me back to our hand and all the things that we wrote about and thought about that Jesus is to us. And one of the wonderful things that Jesus is to me is that he's a teacher. Yes. And the New Testament has the lessons that he taught us. All the, and last week we learned about building God's kingdom through everything that we say and everything that we do. That's, we know how to do and we know what to do and what to say because Jesus taught us. That's right. He's our teacher. And in the Bible, about his life, there's lots of things that, that say he's our teacher. I'm going to read from, the, from Matthew's Gospel. Jesus teaches and preaches. Jesus went all over Galilee, teaching in the synagogues and preaching the good news about the kingdom. Large crowds followed him from Galilee and the ten towns from Jerusalem, Judea and the land on the other side of the Jordan. And Jesus saw the crowds and went up a hill where he sat down and his disciples, that's the people who followed him, gathered round him, and he began to teach them. And he told them stories so that they'd remember things. And he taught them how to live and how to build God's kingdom. That's right. And later on, also in Matthew's Gospel, it says that Jesus said, Let the children come to me. Don't stop them, because the kingdom of heaven belongs to them. He wanted people to know, he wanted everyone to know that just as children listen to teachers, and listen to their moms and dads, we need to all be like that. Not only when you're children like you are, but you're learning to listen to moms and dads and to Miss Carr and Mrs. Kyle and all your teachers that you'll have. But you need to remember that your whole life to be listening to Jesus' voice in you because he's our most amazing and most wonderful teacher. And we can find all the lessons that he taught us in the Bible. Let us pray. Dear Lord, thank you that you lived among us to teach us. Thank you for sharing your life with us and teaching us how to build God's kingdom, teaching us the lessons of how to love each other and how to do the right things, make the right choices. Help us always, Jesus, to remember those lessons and to live them. Thank you for being my teacher. Amen. Have a blessed and beautiful day, everybody.